Hi, I just want to here. Uh, I just want you to walk with me today, right? and uh, we just chat. I'll try to talk a bit louder because it's actually a busy area. Uh, this is actually this place is called Bridge Eight, right? It's uh, it's in Edinburgh, right? For you guys that uh, are planning on coming to Edinburgh, make sure you do come to uh, Bridge Eight, right? I don't know how much the charges and everything, right? Uh, I wish I could tell you the prices, but again, you might be watching this years later. So, uh, Bridget is quite a cool place, right? To come and do kayaking, uh, canoeing, all those kind of things, right? But really, the one thing I want to talk about right now is... Uh, you can see it's such a busy place. People are passing by with bicycles. Some of them are running, just enjoying themselves, right? It's fun time, so uh, I just have to be careful while I'm walking down the road, right? Uh, which I'll try to be, okay? And uh, yeah, but I wanted us to talk, right? To really talk a little bit about, you know, why you need the blessing of your parent, right? Guys, listen here, right? In the Bible, right? Which is, I think, I would suggest every one of us should actually read the Bible once in a while. Um, in the Bible, it teaches us that honor your father and your mother so that your days may be, may be many, right? You may live a long life. Basically, that's what it's saying, right? But, uh, let me look at the back, guys. Let me see if there's anybody. Oh, no, there's nobody coming there, so we're okay. Right, so, um, right, so honor your mother and your father through so the days may be made. It's one of the most powerful things, actually, guys. And uh, don't undermine, undermine your parents. Your parents are very, very important, right? I remember, uh, I remember when I was growing up, right? Our, my parents actually they used to emphasize a lot on this that you must honor your parents so that your days may be made. They, they used to sing this thing for me. I was wondering where they get it from, but later on I discovered actually they got it from the Bible, right? So it's a very powerful thing that you need to do, right? And if you have ever had your problems with your parents, right? Let's say you are one of those guys that uh, don't talk to your parents anymore, you know, don't care about your parents anymore, please go back and make sure you, you say sorry to them and uh, because it's it's a blessing right you know the words that your parents speak to you especially when they are blessing you right uh they're very powerful words right i'll keep on checking and see if anybody's coming behind us there guys because that's my only concern if a bicycle or something comes too fast for me you know i don't want to be hurt right right on camera on life right <laughs> okay now guys so uh honoring your parents is one of the most powerful things so when i grew up right I remember I had a big problem with my dad, right? Long story, cut this long, long story short. Basically, uh, a few things didn't go right between me and my dad when I was growing up. Hey, let me put it this way, actually. Uh, when I was in primary five, uh, uh, my mom moved, uh, left my dad. Uh, they, 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 they separated, right? So which means I went away with my mom. But then my dad blocked our ability to go to go to the next school right so basically we were stuck until uh there was an intervention there that's how we managed finally managed so for that reason right i had a big problem with him and didn't want even to talk to him but uh later on in life i realized i had to forgive him and i forgave him and became friends again right so my my dad died many so a few years ago and but he died with a blessing for me right so which was good right those are the kind of things you need to do guys and um, my mom have always been friends right even up to now to this this day right so but i remember when i was uh, uh i think this is one of the things that really made gave me a breakthrough when i was actually in uh, primary six I, re I discovered something guys that i just couldn't read right couldn't read like like reading uh, anything uh, written in in English right and I couldn't read even in my I don't think I could even read in my own on, on my mother my mother tongue right so I, I had struggles with reading so what I decided to do was that I took one big huge book right started reading it this book was written in English right 
I started reading it and I read it and I read it and I read it. And I remember I would go in front of my mom and read this book. This is when, when I got all my blessings, guys. And uh, now I'm telling you my secret. <laughs> so whenever I was reading this book in front of my mom, my mom would just be saying, oh, you, you are going to be great. You, you are going to succeed. You, you are going to be, you know, very educated. You, you are going, she was pouring all these blessings, right? So it's one of those tips that I give to people, right? Go out there and do something for your, for your, for your parents, right? And let them bless you, right? It's not the only thing that I did, right? I did a lot, of, a lot of other things, right? Because it's very powerful, guys, to have a blessing of your parents. Let your parents say good things about you. Go there whenever you meet. You go to your parents, right? Serve them, right? Make some tea for them, right? Um, make some fire for something. I don't know what you do, right? Do something for them, right? Uh, send them a bit of money if you if you are working, right? Or if you, are, you have a business, send them in a bit of money. Let them bless you. Blessing of your parents is the most powerful thing, guys. Your parents should be proud of you. Okay, it doesn't matter how old they are. It doesn't have doesn't mean that when they are young, that's when they you should love them. But even when they are old, you should still, still love them. Okay, right. I hope that's been uh, uh, very helpful to you guys. And uh, go out there and share it with your friends, with whoever you know, and their lives will never be the same again. And uh, we'll talk again very soon. And also, guys, if you are struggling with uh, recruiting, struggling with marketing yourself, uh, make sure you contact me on Facebook, social media, anywhere you can get me, right? Let's talk and let's see if we can be able to help you. Thank you so much and bye for now.